water quality around a modern landfill. Blue Creek flows near the Turkey Run Landfill. The landfill opened in 2009. It was developed by Ernest Kaufman and much of the same Solid Solutions development team that is now proposing a similar landfill in Harrelson County, Georgia. One of the first things we noticed when we looked at the property here in Meriwether County was a creek that had been straightened out by farmers back in the 50s when the government was actually paying farmers to drain the land. There were lots of erosion and silt and it was pretty much a dead creek. While building the landfill in Industrial Park, Blue Creek was returned to its natural state. Blue Creek flows alongside the Turkey Run landfill, less than 100 yards from one of the cells. It crosses the landfill property, emptying into Lake Jimmy Jackson, a freshwater reservoir. They did some work on that stream. They did a lot of work on that stream. The stream had channelized, they came in and redirected it, brought in, I can't tell you how many tons of rock that prevented the silting over of our lake. The landfill's construction and operation have protected the creek's water quality for more than a dozen years, just as it was designed to do. We began using it as our water supply probably in 05 or 06, maybe 15 years ago. We have since stopped using it as a water supply. But we did, we did establish the Lake Jimmy Jackson uh, recreation area. We put in a, uh, a recreation area. We have a beach. We have uh, fishing piers, uh, picnic areas. Uh, so we've converted that, what was our water supply, we've converted into a, a, a recreation area. And that is one of the things that I talked about, about what brings people to your locale. There has to be those kind of amenities for them. I trusted these smart people that were in charge. I knew that there were engineers, there were research people, there were scientists, there were all these people that had done all this research. I know not a lot about like EPA and the environmental stuff, but I knew they would not let it happen if it wasn't safe. Well, first of all, because it was our water supply, we constantly had to check that, that water supply. We had to check it on the input into our water filtration plant and of course, obviously, the output from the plant. We've always had quality water coming from, from that reservoir, but we've never had an issue with water quality for a city's water system. Never had any problem like that.